That's what I mean by beautiful country. Oh. Oh, it's the 18 getting her in. Swain, 18, take two to be dead on with a four, 22 package. Taylor was 17, dead seven, a 24 package. Two thousands. My goodness. Casey Prince will come up left lane. Williamson, Georgia, 484 dial in. Michael Carpenter in the right lane dial of 482. Gently, gently. There we go. Prince turns it right up high. Four over for the win. 486 with a zero at 141. Prince turns it red. Goes 484 at 142. Dustin Long will come up left lane. If the body panels are correct, that would be a 62 Corvette Roadster. 520 dial in the left lane. Brandon Taylor, BT in the right side. Dragcoverage.com and FTI. The purple dragster dial to 480. I remember the pictures. I can't believe that was a year ago already, Victor. He was really late on the tree. And he still didn't get there first, breaking it out by a bunch. Brandon Taylor on the right side. 007 and goes five high and still 12,000s in front. Brandon Taylor gets the wind light there, and Dustin Long will put the Corvette in the box. Brad Barkley will come up in the right lane. 473 dial in, Rob Leipziger on a 457 dial. Yeah, a little late. Just a little. for the win 15 dead three 473 with a three at 144 leipziger was 30 and breaks it out three thousands trying to get there doesn't make it timmy smith will come up on the right hand side roanoke mafia out of roanoke alabama 469 dial in burleson in the left lane from richmond texas will dial a 452 Breaks it out, a foul. 12, take 14 to be 1,000 under. Timmy Smith, 17, dead eight for the win. 469 with an eight at 141. Burleson, 451 with a nine on a 452 dial-in, doesn't help. 
Steve Law come up in the left lane. The Law Chevrolet Group out of Boonville, Indiana. 474 dial in. Now, trying to remember, this is Hugh Meeks, I believe, in the dragster on the right side. 469 is his dial. Take five to be one over for the win. 470 with a one at 145. Law was 12, one over, no help. Ty Casey, left lane. 478, the down on the left side. Right lane will be Micah Mann. Down from Indianapolis, 466, down on the right side. The cones are simply for guidance. So you can see the groove. Because when it gets dark, it's hard to see the groove down there. Casey, 13 dead one. 13 take four. 478 with a one at 143 for Ty Casey. Micah Mann was 004 and feeds him the finish line. And Casey says, thank you. I'll take it for the win light. 467 with a four and at 466 dialing for Mann. Casey gets the win. Brett Williamson coming up here. Left lane all the way down from Durand, Illinois, Rockford area, 478 dial in. Driving that old dragster. Adam Russell on the right side, down to 464. Sixty-four. the dial he runs it with a nine 25 on the tree 148 miles an hour for adam russell 464 with a nine at 148 now to bring up colby fuller fuller in the left lane out of savannah georgia went a long way down to 16 cars i think he was doubled at 16 and lost both entries if i remember correctly yesterday for the uh Race Star Pro Thursday, Friday, 60K race. So he took some cash home. 505 dialing for Fuller. Nathan Martin in the right side. He's on a 466. Who's taking some cash away from this place before? The advantage goes to Colby Fuller in the left lane to win. 506 with a three at 138 on a 22 bulb. Final, final call, round number three. Final, final call, round number three. If you're supposed to be in round three and you have not yet made your round three pass, you are late. Make your way to staging now, please. Here comes the pool boy, Bo Boatner, right side. Dragcoverage.com on the side of that car. 482 down on the right lane. Christopher Northrup in the left lane. On a 470.
Northrop. Left lane, 18, one over for the win. 471 with a five at 146. He was 18 on the tree, 470 was his dial. Bodner in the right lane was dead on with a zero after that 001 light, red light. He was ready. Just a little too quick. We're finishing up on the tail end of Mosier Engineering round number three here in our Race Star Pro Sunday $30,000 to win race. Mark Kidd and Bart Nelson coming at us now. Kidd out of Idaho left lane, 484 dial in. And Bart Nelson in the right side from Texas dialed on a 481. Double O seven takes six. To be dead on with a seven. Fourteen thousands package. Nelson was eighteen on the tree, and then dead two. So his twenty package. The kid's fourteen package. Of course, he was eliminated before he left starting line. He was eighteen on the tree. The kid's fourteen package. A slow six second car. <laughs> Round four door cars, all of you need you to the lanes, please. Round four door cars, all of you need you to the lanes. Again, round four door cars, need you to the lanes, please, all of you. Alan Rickle gets the wind light there, 003, dead eight. He's 10,000 package in Troy Williams. Is 12 on the reaction time. Wind light goes to Wickle. That'll bring up Jamie Bridge and Coach Gilly. 470. It's 003 for Bridge, and he's behind Galitti. Perfect run. 454 with a zero after a triple O reaction time. Perfect run for Chris Galitti. That's the second perfect run today. And Jamie Bridge had a 10,000s package and, and is going in the trailer. 003, dead seven, and going in the trailer. Chris Galitti, second package, perfect package of the day. James Barnes coming up in the left lane, 594 dial in. And Tim Thomas, 461 is his dial in the right lane in the dragster. Once again, I've called door cars. Door cars, all of you for round four. Round four door cars, I need you all to the lanes now, please. Round four door cars, I need you to the lanes. Yeah, Mo, I remember seeing you were there, but no car. Well, Indy's a different animal anyways. Ten thousand separate on this over racetrack. It's Thomas. Thirteen. Take one to be one over, 462 with a three at 144 miles an hour, a thousand separate them. 13 and 13, 26 package for Barnes, 27 package for uh, Barnes, 26 package for Thomas. Barnes is 15, one over with a two. More tight racing, Gage Birch comes up left lane. 631 dial for the Mustang. Plot in the right side dial of 531.
that's going to be Plot. He's 14 on the tree. Birch gets there first. He's 26, gets 32 in front to break out 200s. Plot on the right side, 14 2 over for the win. 533 with a 4 and 129. That'll bring up Jeff Smith. Plymouth, Indiana, left lane, 473 the dial and taking on Peeps Pennington. Peeps so will dial a 463. to be 5,000 under. Smith was 32 and 5,000 under. It was all right here at the starting line. Wind line goes to Peeps Pennington, 462 with a five at 148. I guess we're gonna go with this Corey Galitti and the Roadster thing in the right side. 502 dialing in the right lane. Joel LaPierre, dragster in the left lane on a 468. Oh, great, now we got commercials in the chat. Here gets the wind light there. 16 on the tree, dead three at 146. Corey, or maybe Michael Pennington, I'm not sure. 27 on the tree, 502 with a five on a 502. Dial was not enough. Joel LaPierre will move on to the next round. That'll bring up Lester Atkins. Atkins in the left lane on a 465. Brian Kennedy in the right side. Odessa, Texas, dial 464. Joanne keeps a tight watch on the chat room. Yeah, I, I know, Brittany. I know it was a roadster, I, and I said that, but I, it had Corey's number on it, so I don't know. Doesn't matter now. He's kind of late, but he's going to get a win light there. 31, dead eight for the win. 465 with an eight, 147 miles an hour. Change, you trying to sleep over there or something? Here comes Sherman Adcock again. 524 dial in for the Roadster. Ma Maverick Palmateer on the right side, dial a 466.
Hancock. 16 dead two for the win. 524 with a total at 133. Paul Mateer was 2,000 to red and 4,000 under. Five eighty dial in the left lane. Don't know who that is. Not on file. Jason Lynch will come up on the right hand side though. Cavalier old super stock car. Five sixty one down for Lynch. Take nine to be three over. 564 with a two at 113. Left lane was 13, three over with an eight. Astros win game three. Here comes Cole Langford. Camaro on the right side. 591 will be his dial in. He'll be taking on David Bird Jones. Bird 467 will be his dial. And Langford is being pushed off. Bird gets him a bye. No bye. I'm not sure what happened there, but left before the third amber and goes 499 for the win. As Langford, unfortunately, has issues, they back him off the starting line and we'll get him out of the way. have called round four door cars so if you're not here round four door cars you need to be here Larry Smith will come up in the left lane Gulfport Mississippi 513 dial in Johnny Brandon on the right side dial on a 480 Round four, dragsters, start making your way back to the staging lanes, please. Round four, dragsters, start making your way back to the staging lanes. Dead two for the win. Johnny Brandon was late. He goes dead on with a four, but he's far enough behind on this end that it really didn't matter. 5-13 with a two for Larry Smith after a double 9 bulb. That 11,000s package brand was much farther along than that. Nick Ferraro will come up on the right-hand side. S10 pickup truck dial on a 616. He'll take on Eric Pavisic. Something like that. 475 dial in for the dragster in the left lane. So Ferraro, the pickup truck, 616, Pavisic and the Dragster, 475.
Jevicic turns it red by a foul and goes dead on with a six. And when he sees the other side of that time slip, he's going to be mad. But Ferraro gets the win light. He's dead on with a three, but he was really late on this end of the racetrack. Hal Blevins and Shane Carr were coming up now. 632 dial in for the Chevy 2. Blevins, 446 dial for Shane. Shane's already got him a nice big check today. As we're finishing up round number three. That's Mosier Engineering, round number three in our Race Star Pro Sunday 30K. made a trip to the center line and stayed on it for a while. He was 007. He'll take 43 to be one whole hundredth under. 631 with a zero at 106. Shane Carr was 25 on the tree and one over. 447 with a five for the win at 152. Levins had him on the tree, took a bunch, and we'll be going in the box. Here comes Jeff Serra, 474 dialing in the right lane, and Tyler Bohannon in the left lane dialed a 461. I'd take a taste of that Pendleton Mo. Track. Left lane Bohannon gets there first by 2,000, goes dead on with a zero. 15 dead zero. Sarah, 11 dead on with a six. 17 thousands package to a 15 thousands package. Four sixty two dial in, dragster in the left lane, not on file. Gene Heaton, Vancouver, Washington. Some of you West Coast guys might know this guy. 446 down in the right lane for Gene Heaton. Gene Heaton may not be around much longer. He's not. 23 on the tree for the left lane and dead on with a 6. 462 with a 6 at 147. Heaton was 43, dead five, and it was all over. Corvette Roadster on the right-hand side, another name not on file, 539 dial in. Taking on Ty Casey in the left lane, 477 is his dial. May or may not. Yeah. Wind light there is going to go to Casey. He was 009 one over. I can have your attention in the pits, please. Cole Langford. Cole Langford. Need you at the base of the tower, please. Cole Langford. <laughs> Need you to the base of the tower, if you would, please. Cole Langford. Go see Jenny in the office, please. Here comes Darren Lotz, Waynesboro, Virginia. 477 down on the right lane. Left lane will be Dustin Long. Go back on that South Dakota conversation. Mitchell, South Dakota, 459. Watts turns it red. 
Dustin. Dustin Long, really, really, really late. And a wind light. 458 with a six at 149 miles an hour for Dustin Long. He gets a wind light there. Aaron Lotz turns it red, 18 thou, and cruises to the top end. Will Holloman and David Taylor coming up now. Holloman on the right side. 469 is his dial. Taylor in the left lane dials a 460. Taylor moved over to his left lane. Looks like we had a little lane swapping going on here because I see the Pinto over there too. Take the wind light there. 13 dead three, 26,000's package. 469 with a three. Taylor was dead on with a nine, but he was 21 on this end. No good. Change, you're losing. That's two in a row. Uh, Jake Clayton, the Pinto coming up in the left lane. Little wheel stand in action. 604 dialing. He's got to calm down a little bit from what it was earlier in the week. 473 right lane for the not on filed ra racer. Eleven, four over, six oh eight with a two at one ten. Six oh eight with a two at one ten. Jake Clayton. I already said that, I think. Bart Nelson and Cassie Pennington. So this is a buy car. Bart Nelson in the left lane, four eighty the dial. Cassie Pennington, four sixty five. It's her dial. She's in the right lane. Take 19 to be 5,000s under. Give her the runner-up on her by run. Bart Nelson, 12-1 over for the win, 481 with a two. So that means in round number four, the by will be Chris Galitti, who had, had another perfect run. Cassie was perfect in round two. Galitti perfect in round three that we just finished up. That's <laughs> I got to drive out to Oregon and meet Mo for a sip of Pendleton, and I should be back in an hour ago. Round four, all of you should be here. Round four, all of you, door cars and dragsters, you should all be here. Door cars and dragsters, round four, you should be here now. Night shift just walked in. All door cars and all dragsters, you should be in the lanes. All cars for Jags round four, you should be here.
Once again, all cars for Jags round four. I need you here. Door cars and dragsters round four. Need you to the lane. Phone's already buzzing. Let's see what we got here. Shout out to Charlie Lockhart and everyone else who's at Epperson's house watching. I'm assuming the Epperson's. Couple of bad dudes off the bottom that I'm sure I'll see next weekend. Only question is which cars Josh Epperson bring it? Is he bringing the truck or is he bringing the Mustang? I'm sure Charlie's bringing both of his. Derek Fuller left side, down 592. We'll take on, it says Jerry Lone. This Jerry's riding in Top Gun, dialed 589. time of Derek Fuller triple zero two above four to be 24 total gets their first seven foul lone 028 dead three no good Derek Fuller moving on Nick Smith just sent me a text that he'll be here at 530 you're insane brand new race car untested Rolling in, he's gonna race the million. B Folk left side, Brian Folk down 502, taking on Brian Whitworth. BW down 624. 624, oh my gosh, they've got this thing dialed way up from the other day. Cool, you, you're the baddest dude in Louisiana. I don't care what you say. I want no part of that red S10. Not even a little bit. But I'm nobody. Who what Amanda says. Amanda says, Epperson says he's not coming. What is this? Josh Epperson... I mean, I've never, never called a man a coward before. But if you're not in Holly Springs next week, you're kind of looking like one. And that's easy for me to say from a lot of hours away. 11,000 for him. Win light will go to Brian Whitworth. 13, one above, gets their first sixth foul. Folk, 24, and also one over. Gets him sixth foul behind. Brian versus Brian, and Whitworth comes out on top. Left side is a not on foul, out 559. Take it on Jody Davies. Jody dialed at 642, driving Hot Wheels. That is what they call that hot rod. Wind light goes to the left lane, 15, one above two, picks up the win, Davies. Double O two, take 31 to be six thou under. Jody hogging it up down there. Left side will pick up the win. 
There's Kosler, but I know that's Chris Koslick. Dialed 583. Take it on James West. West dialed 626. Nick Smith says he's coming to get that $20. I did say if Nick Smith showed up with a brand new race car at the million, I would give him $20. Come and get it, buddy. You can park right next to me. James West, 21 and one above, gets their first 11th foul and picks up the win. Koslick, 031 and one above, no good. Danny Grissom left side. Dialed 6.30 to take on Jeff Brown. Brown dialed 5.30. Never mind, that is definitely Cody Barnhart. Can't see due to this banner. I should know that. Picks up a win line, 026, and two above, take three foul. Brown, 031, and one over, and three foul behind. Riley Howard, left side. Dialed 566, your most recent Cal Pasture Nationals champion. We'll take on Ricky Jones. Jones dialed 561. There is people on the live feed like, what did you just say he won? And why should we care? Well, it is the second longest running bracket race in the country. And it's at my home track. So there's that. Round three, best losing package while we're doing a little cleanup. Ken Sullivan picking up a spool and axle package from the fine folks of Mosier Engineering. You talk somebody up, they will always bring you down. Riley Howard, 14, take 43 to be a foul under. Tricky Ricky, 47, and dead on nine, picks up the win, and he will roll into round number five. Mm. Frank on J left side, dialed 532, take on Dwayne Roberts. Roberts dialed 601. Winlight, Roberts, 13, two above, picks up the win as Anjay is 18, take 20 to be three foul under the dial. Cody Moore, that is correct. Riley is the second most recent as Cody Moore did win the Sunday of the Cow Pastures. Brad Clark left side out at 467, take it on Cole Cousins. Cold out at 640. Two thousand. Win like 
goes to Cousins, 007 and three over. Gets there first, six foul. Clark, 009 and four high. No good. And apparently I'm whispering sweet nothings into Jake Hodge's ear. Well, don't I feel special? Justin Wright, left side, dialed 583. Taking on James Barnes. Barnes dialed 594. Twenty-five dead on two to be twenty-seven total gets their first thirty-nine foul right. Oh, forty-one and two above, no good. Pretty good matchup here. Sherman Adcock left side, former million-dollar winner, dialed five twenty-four, taking on Nick Ross. Ross driving the Monza dialed at five sixty-eight. <laughs> Hashtag drag week. Oh, 12 foul separated. Has a lot of zeros. And that one wins. Nick Ross, perfect. Dead on nine. Takes 16 foul. Adcock, 12 and one above. No good. Nick Ross, flat and nasty. Turn on the wind light. Blake Gentry left side. Out 462. Taking on Michael Pennington. Pennington dialed 5-0. Two. I don't think I've ever taken as many Snapchat pictures as I did on Drag Week. There was a lot. There was a lot of six shooters going around. Great time. Never gone on Drag Week. Definitely need to do it. Gives the win to Gentry, who's 045 and two above. Nailed it. That was the lap he was looking for. Mark Kidd left side, dial 484. Take it on Tommy Plot. Tommy dial 532. Kid 15, one above, take 20 as plot 14 and three above will not turn on the wind light. Mark Kid to round five. Last call, round four. Last call, round four. Need you to the lanes. Last call, round number four. Need you to the lanes. Left side. Tyler Bohannon dialed at 460. We'll take on Jason Lynch. Racing Jason dialed 559. Once again, last call, round four. Last call, round four. If you have not gone down the racetrack for Jegs, round four, and you're supposed to be here, well, you are late. My favorite question to answer was, what does Ryan do on the Drag Week crew? A whole lot of nothing. I can run some fiber. Wind light. Going to Bohannon, 007 and one above. Take 42. Lynch, 34 and three above. No good. Tyler Bohannon will move on. 
Lester Atkins left side, dialed 465. We'll take on Colby Fuller. Fuller dialed 505. He brought me lunch once. <laughs> My main question was the first day we got there. And I was like, well, we're at, drag, we're, at a, we're at a racetrack. We have Jake Hodge and Ryan Gleghorn on the TV crew, not in front of a camera or on a microphone for a week. Felt very backwards to me. Culture shock, if you would. I don't even think I stepped foot in the tower. I don't even know what that's like anymore. Atkins turns it Fuller, 18, and clicks it off early. So that's enough race car for me. Thank you very much. I've had enough. Lev. Funny car, Chris, left side. Chris Northrop, down 471. We'll take on Travis Colangelo. Whelan Fenders, down 485. Me and Chris have to swap stories after this round's over. Larry Smith, left side. Dodd 513. We'll take on, I believe that is Hugh Meeks in that hot rod. Dodd 469. We're all taking the back seat to Brian Loans. Can't compete. I'm the middle of the mall version of Brian Loans. Great value version, if if you will. Six dead three, no good. Hugh Meeks moves on. Turbo Ty Casey left side dialed four seventy seven. Take on Michael Carpenter. Carpenter dialed four eighty six. Jones, I was told differently. See, that's what my computer said, but I was told that he was in the dragster today. A lot of car swapping going on here in our Raystar Pro 30K. We just can't pull it off this equipment, Jake. Loans is built to last like they're last. Wind light, ooh. Go 
one to tie Casey 034 in one over. Gets there by 10. Carpenter, 009 and five above. Huh. Ty Casey moves on. Bill Swain dialed 456. We'll take on Tim Thomas. Thomas dialed 461. Jody, I don't know what's in that drink that you have there, but you are definitely not thinking straight. <laughs> I do appreciate it, though. Tim Thomas' hot right has brake lights. I like it. And he gets a win line. 007, two above. Gets there by one ten foul. Zero, 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 one. Tim Thomas moves to round five. Bill Swain, 021, one above four. No good. Tim Thomas moves on. Joel LaPierre, dot four, 68. Take it on Shane and Justice. Shane and out 487. I'm pretty proud of myself. All day, no Facebook. That's a record for me. The world doesn't need to know the details, Jim, okay? Let me live in my small victories. <laughs> Winlight going to Shannon. 20, dead on one, taking nine foul. LaPierre, 24, dead six. Will not turn on a wind light. What did Andy Small have to say today? Race the baby face assassin is driving the blue kid dragster. Gotcha. The race is driving daddy's car. Bart Nelson left side. I know that's Bart. About 481. Take on Miss Mia Tedesco. There's no telling who's driving that hot rod. But says Mia, I'm going with Mia. with one total. Wow. Our 60K winner left side, Shane Carr. Sugar down 448. Take it on Will Holloman. Holloman down 469. This should be a good lap. A classic, if you will. Oh, Winlight Holloman. 
23. One above gets their first 14 foul. Sugar, 017, puts it three above to get 14 foul behind. Holloman will move on. Tebow, Tyler Bohannon back around, dialed 461, taking on Sean Sarah. Sean dialed 465. Light goes to Tyler Bohannon. Double O two dead four six total gets behind six thou. Sarah three takes six to be three thou under. Had to take three or less. Wow. I said there's a classic. I just picked the wrong pair. Left side Blake Gentry down four sixty four. Take it on a BT. Brandon Taylor down four seventy nine. goes to Taylor 16 and two above take 10 Gentry 37 and one above no good David Bird Jones left side the world's greatest mullet dog 465 taking on Bailey Ferraro Bailey does not have a mullet and he's out 473 15, dead 9, take 19 foul. Bailey, 14 and 2 above, no good. David Bird Jones will roll on. Ty Casey back around, out 478. Take it on Dustin Long. Dustin out 459. Puts it dead on zero to get their first 17 foul long. 029, dead seven. No good. Ty Casey moves to round five. I believe with two entries. Cole Langford left side dialed 494. Taking on Jake Clayton. The Pinto dialed 604. Take 29 to be 3 thou under. Langford, 26 and 1 above. We'll move on.
Jeff Serra left side. The Leprechaun down to 474. Take on Jeff Reed Jr. Reed down 538. to Sarah as Reed is very red. Sarah 12 and a bunch over. Timmy Smith left side dialed 469 taking on Adam Russell. Al Capone dialed 465. Russell 001 puts it two above. Take a foul. One take one for Russell. Timmy Smith 11 and one above. No good. Adam Russell will move on. Peeps Pennington left side. The Peep showed out 460. They got Nick Ferraro. Nick dialed 616. Seventh thou under. We have two pair left. Waiting on a couple of guys to get back around.
I hear race cars. Will Holloman is racing himself. I like it. Oh, never mind. Brad Barclay on the right side. Holloman left side down 470. Take on Brad Barclay down 473. Take 15 foul, Holloman. 32 and one over, no good. Barclay will move on. I believe this is last pass of the night. Chris Galetti sends it way deep in the burnout. Chris Galetti out 452, take on Jake Clayton. Jake dialed 603. But about to end up Jeg's round four. When light goes to Gletty, 009, dead on three. Gets there first, 37 thou, Clayton, 035. And one above no good that concludes jegs round four And that's a wrap. <laughs> Guys, please remind them uh, to uh, pull the E data for uh, for the 60K so I can put those results up. Okay. Anyway, uh, okay, we finished through uh, curfew is what we finished through. So let's see, what is it? 07. Um, and congratulations to Sugar Shane car uh for his win on the 60k and uh you know we let me get this the right way this way okay we um we normally we we didn't get the 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 cue 
that they were in the lanes and it was right in the middle of round one so i apologize for that we had the graphic ready it was ready it was in the queue ready to fire but uh but no one gave us the signal so <laughs> i'm sorry sugar shane um shane Just Carr, got phones, Randy congratulations Fult. and congratulations so we are done to for Paul the night Bitch. Uh, for the runner-up in that. We're starting up at okay, 9 Okay, I'm going to uh, go through. Here's and the game plan moving there's forward. There's just a couple of things to do. And if and we then, wake up in the uh, morning. We'll see you tomorrow. And weather does not look good. 9 a.m., okay? Uh, preferably, it will be at any point sunshine. Of the day, and we, we will, will finish be ready Sunday's Raystar Pro okay. Wheels. Bye. I love you. 30K event. See you in the morning. And then, weather permitting.